trying to lay down her paws up. We keep giving her treats while she sits still and we can shade her belly and do an ultrasound in one sitting without having to sedate her. I can't even get my dog to do that. So she's very smart. She learns by mimicking. So we don't ask behaviors of her so much when we're teaching something new. We mimic. So our senior keeper that's been with her since the beginning will actually lay down next to the crate and by you nose to lay down as well. So yeah, this is by you, 20 years old, 215 pounds. She's had five babies here in San Diego. Her first four are already in China. They are part of a breeding program that's out there. San Diego Zoo is involved in the conservation of giant pandas as well as other animals that are from the Sichuan province of China. That includes all the animals that you walked through. You saw the red panda, the vipers, the Sichuan talking. It helps all of those animals as well with the work we're doing for the giant panda. Now her first cub was born in 1999. Her name was Wame. Wame was the first baby panda to survive in the United States. Wame is now in China. She has had eight of her own babies. 